So, just recently, we got approved as the only site in Africa to conduct a phase 1B trial using a drug that specifically blocks the effects of a cancer-causing gene. So, there's a gene called KRAS, K-R-A-S. It's what we call a housekeeping gene. It's present in all cells. It's responsible for cells growing, repairing damage, etc. In normal individuals, the KRAS gene gets activated, cells grow, repair damage, and the cells go, and the gene goes back to quiescence. So it's only required during activity. In some cancers, 30% of tumors, the KRAS gene is mutated. It is active. It's on all the time. Cells grow, don't stop growing. They grow over each other. They spread, they metastasize, all because of the mutation of this particular gene. Now, there's a specific gene called KRAS G12C, a unique mutation that is present in lung cancer, colon cancer, and other cancers. We, as a first site in Africa, as the only site that has a clinical trial, if we have a cancer patient whose tumor has the KRAS G12C mutation, we have a pill that specifically blocks the activity of this cancer-causing gene. We block the gene from becoming activated. We stop the cells from progressing, from growing, from spreading. If this works, it is a good sign that we can treat cancer early based upon what we call precision oncology. This is treatment at molecular level, at the genetic level, where we don't care what cancer you have. You could have breast cancer, lung cancer, any cancer. If you have that particular gene responsible for the growth of your tumor, and we have a blocker, we block the activity of the source of the cancer itself. That precision medicine is what we do today. We have a clinical trial specifically for the gene blocker that blocks the activity of the KRAS G12C mutation. If you have cancer, have failed chemotherapy, come to AKU, we can test your tumor cells based upon just a blood cell, blood draw. In the blood, we'll have circulating tumor cells. We can detect those, look at the genetic makeup, and if you have the mutation, you would potentially be eligible for this trial. And we had the first patient, did very well, minimal side effects, significant benefit if this is the driver mutation for this patient's tumor because we have a blocker for this driver mutation.